Hello folks, Curmudgeon here. When the other shoe drops, it's my job to chew it. So everybody's a buzz over the indictments. Even the cats are talking about it. People, what's new here? I know your noses are pathetic, but don't they at least wrinkle a little when the guy in charge of the oil and gas committee in the house is under FBI investigation? Don't they wrinkle just a little? When Vico hands out thousands of dollars in campaign contributions and then sends it to execs to Juno with their hands out? The way you people finance campaigns would make a hyena puke. And the fact that ethics reform seems stalled over infighting about who gets the credit in this context seems especially hard to understand. Just hold an auction and award it to the highest bidder. And hey, you better do it fast before more indictments come down. If the FBI keeps hauling people away in handcuffs, it's going to be tough to round up enough bodies for a quorum. Earlier this year, you people had the gall to ban dogs from the Capitol building. Well, I'll make you a deal. I'll be pleased to avoid what's looking more and more like a cat house if you'll keep your sleazy politicians out of my dog house. This is Kermudson saying, hey, when was the last time you saw a dog on a perp walk?